What was the wildest rumor in your school that turned out to be true? My school was an all boys school and shared a fence with the all girls school. This girl named Zoe would give hand jobs through the fence for five pounds. High school football head coach got caught in his office banging a player's grandmother. It was just a rumor for a while after he got fired until another coach admitted to several students that he was the one who caught them. A kid jerked in the hallway after school hours in a camera blind spot. Eighth grade science teacher was a crackhead. Cops busted her and I got in trouble for bringing the news article in for the weekly current events assignment in social studies. Coach Carter making out with Tran Pak in the film room above the auditorium. Dude stuck his phone camera under the cubicle divider in the pool changing rooms and filmed a 12 year old girl getting changed. He since moved schools because he couldn't set foot in the building without getting beaten up or yelled at by someone. Last I heard someone keyed his mum's car. Our school's dance instructor was asking at least one girl at our school for nudes, he was also beep another girl I knew according to her best friend, who I was seeing at the time. What's crazy is this guy and his dance crew went on to win America's best dance crew. That one of our science professors who was fresh out of college when she was employed at our high school made out with a student who turned 18. This was a few years before I attended high school. During senior prom when I attended high school she admitted it under the influence of alcohol to some of the kids in my graduating class lol. There was a rumor that the female students in the year below us had started a prostitution ring. I didn't believe it was true until I was chatting with a few of them. Turns out they collectively figured out they could make a little pocket money instead of just having sex with the guys in school for free, and they were completely oblivious to the fact it was literal prostitution. At my Christian elementary school, the principal who was married to the fifth grade teacher was Beep the married school secretary, who had two children enrolled at the school. Freshman year we had a youngish new biology teacher. She was nice in kind of an erratic way. One day she was just gone. Turned out one of the boys in another class started mocking her and telling her that her husband, who was army and active duty overseas at the time, was gonna die. She didn't care for that much so, in front of the entire class, she chucked a fetal pig at him. Dissection days were always weird, but that took the cake. High school history teacher, who was also the soccer coach, quit because he caught two students beep in the field house. I went to an all-boys high school. That there was a wolf in the school's basement. It was actually a coyote. Transportation instructor was messing with boys. Committed suicide. Someone downloaded a pirated version of Minecraft onto the school's network so everyone could open it and play on LAN servers. No one knew who downloaded it. Rumors were going around that the bully in the 8th grade, this was middle school, that hated Minecraft was the one who did it. He always teased everyone for playing it at lunch break instead of going outside. It turns out he was the one who put it on the network, as he admitted right before he graduated. That copy of Minecraft stayed on the network for two more years that I went to that school, and might still be there to this day if they haven't gotten new computers. There was a rumor at my school a girl left a goat. No one truly believed it until the video popped up around the school. Turns out that that same girl started the rumor about herself in hopes it would make her seem cool. It didn't. P teacher was banging the girls basketball team. 50 plus and they're all, you know, kids. Gross. Didn't get fired for a few years. A 14 year old girl got pregnant and miscarried. She also kissed her cousin. A lot. An autistic kid pooped in the urinal. One guy put a flash drive into a computer to present a project and it popped up gigabytes of hentai. Another guy plugged his iPhone into a library computer and it uploaded like 50 dick pics. That the principal who retired just before I went to the school had pulled some serious beep and had been forced to retire. It turned out he had three blonde girls with weekly appointments with him who got glowing recommendations to the colleges of their choice despite being mediocre students. He literally had sex appointments with three students each week. He was forced to retire or face jail time. Also a gay teacher was fired because students found a dildo hidden in a bookcase in his classroom. Turned out he was getting his rocks off during lunch break in the classroom. He never did anything with students present or anything and always made sure he blocked all the windows and locked the door. When the dildo was found he spilled the truth and he was forced out. 
Rumors of female twins that went to my high school were doing pornography together. Nobody believed it until their website was leaked by another classmate. Two of the science teachers were beep. They now have a beautiful daughter. Back when I was in high school, all the classrooms were situated on the first three floors of the building. There was a fourth floor to the building, but it was pretty small. I think only one room, which supposedly is where they had used as a science storeroom years back. Before they had remodeled the third floor to include storage spaces in between science classrooms, which eliminated the need for the extra storage space, so the fourth floor was no longer used for anything. As we were high school students, a lot of stupid and bogus rumors were spread quite often while I was there. But one of the rumors that was considered to be quite bogus was that one of the chem teachers was using the fourth floor to secretly cook meth. The rumor spread quite quickly, and they had administrators and even a cop go up there and they never found anything, which dispelled in truth to the rumor. Fast forward a few months later, a drug dog searching the school ended up alerting on the door to the only stairwell that could access the fourth floor. It only went from the third floor to the fourth floor, so students could not access it without the key to the stairwell door. When the dog went up to the fourth floor, it ended up sniffing out a bunch of equipment, and after an investigation, it was found that the chem teacher who was rumored to have cooked meth was the one who was cooking meth on the fourth floor. All girls boarding school, female math teacher and dorm parent sleeping W student. That the PE department was full of pedophiles. Two prosecutions in the last 15 years so far. One happened in my final year, and students were told they would get detention or expelled, etc., if they spoke about it during school hours. Kids being kids, though, we found a way. And for the next fortnight, Pink Floyd's "Another Brick in the Wall" was played and sung constantly, especially during pay. A rumor in my school was that a guy and girl that had just moved there, who were boyfriend and girlfriend, were actually brother and sister. Yeah, they kind of looked alike, but no more than most people can share features with others. Plus, they were in the same grade, so nobody really took it seriously, since they weren't even a year apart age-wise. As far as anyone was concerned, they weren't bro and sis. They were just BF and GF, but the rumor still persisted for some time. I remember them getting pretty pissed whenever it was brought up. Turns out they were both siblings slash lovers, as in full Lannister. They had moved to our district from the East Coast because they had been caught having sex with each other by someone at their school who took pictures and distributed them to the student body. Also, turned out they were Irish twins. The sister was older by ten months, and their birthdays fell just right so that the girl started school a year later. So she and her brother were in the same grade. Only reason we found that out was basically a big ass game of telephone. One of the guy's friends friended one of the guy's old classmates on MySpace, and through casual conversation, picked up on it and sleuthed around and indeed found the aforementioned pics and then started showing them around our school. Their mom, no dad in the picture, not only didn't care, she was supportive of the relationship. Needless to say, they moved again not long after it came out. A girl blew the entire hockey team after they won states. The rumor was that she said she would if they won. Then they won, and unless the entire team was lying. Ooh, that the chick did have a relationship with one of the tradies who was working at the school. They expelled her, and I think they eventually got married. That the AP psych teacher got arrested for hiring a hitman to kill another teacher. Looked up arrest records, and he was in jail for soliciting a hitman. May your day be filled with joy and happiness. And please remember to subscribe to Upvote for the best quality content every day.